Well, Indonesia has called for international help as the death toll from the earthquake and the tsunami has left over 830 people dead, with authorities fearing that it will only climb higher as rescuers are now struggling to reach those who are stranded. The Indonesian President Joko Widodo also visited the earthquake and tsunami devastated city of Palu. Now, this is the scene of devastation after the earthquake struck and the tsunami waves swept over the Sulawesi island. Now, residents who are still fearful of the aftershocks have gathered around as Vidodo walked through the ruined and the collapsed buildings and also visited the Palu shoreline. Ya memang berat, di karena yang pertama di sini jalan menuju ke sini juga banyak yang terputus, bandara juga belum berfungsi, listrik dari tujuh gardu yang hidup baru dua, yang lima belum hidup, BBM nggak bisa menuju ke sini karena memang terhambat oleh jalan-jalan yang terputus.